Right, this is a bit of a mixed bag today. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to show you uh, the Marks and Spencers haul, that, so that will be coming on in a minute. Um, first, um, I'm just going to give you a little update on a review that I've done of um, a cervical pillar, Zamat. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, Z-A-M-A-T, uh, pillar that I was sent, uh, which is supposed to relieve backache, and it does. <laughs> well, it did for me anyway. <laughs> I mean, my back's still not perfect, but a lot. it is a lot better. You know, I feel like I've had a much relaxed sleep. sleep. Anyway, watch this. I'll show you two weeks ago, then now, and then the Marks and Spencers haul. So, <laughs> see you in a bit. And at the end of the video, I'm going to announce the winner for the 4,000 um, subscribers giveaway. Uh, so, stay tuned um, and have a look at the pillow if you get a chance. Um, and enjoy the Marks and Spencers haul and subscribe if you're not if you're not subscribed please subscribe and ring that bell and give me a thumbs up thanks a lot hi this is me two weeks ago um, I took delivery of um, a, a, a lovely pillow that had been sent from a company called Zamat now they're a professional sleep pillow uh, brand company um and they've been going for quite a number of years um and they got they, they asked me if i wanted to try one of their ergonomic pillows um these are supposed to integrate sleep science and cervical therapy um so to help you get a, a good night's sleep if you have like a bad back or a neck pain now i do suffer with a bad back it's mainly at the lower end of my back but my shoulders do hurt as well um, so I thought about it and then I thought, well, I'll give it a try. You know, a lot of people our age do suffer with the backs and I'll, I'll try it out. So anyway, this is me just un unboxing it. Uh, now I have tried this pillow for two weeks because I, I wanted to give you like my true assessment. And I have to say, um, the first couple of nights, um, I wouldn't say it was uncomfortable, but I'm used to a higher pillow. And also, I like a silk pillowcase. Well, of course, this is the pillowcase that's on it. And, um, you know, you can see it's not um, it, it's not silk. But it, what I have to say, I did message them and they said, well, try and persevere with it, which I did. Uh, you can see the cover unzips. Can you see there? Um, and I do think you can slightly adjust the height uh, inside, uh, but I had it at the highest setting. Now, um, I'm used to sleeping on a couple of pillows. So at first, as I say, I, I, I found I didn't think it was high enough. Um, but then after you see, can you see at the side, it's got places for you to place your arms um it's particularly good i would think if you're a stomach sleeper but i tend to sleep on my side and i did find it comfortable uh, i did put a, it over another pillow uh, and i found that so comfortable and i have to say i have what with that and the silk duvet i've had the what best night to say i had i've had the best night's sleep that i've had for ages um so it's me now in real time two weeks later um as as i was when i was doing the voiceover so this is the pillow so if you i think if you're a stomach sleeper you can have it that way can you see so you would lie on it that way or otherwise have it this way and i have to say i don't think you can see it, it see if i can put it down it is. It is really comfortable. I did find it. You know, I will continue to use it because I am really pleased with it. I just wish that they do do spare pillowcases. Um, and um, but they're just the same as this. You know, it'd be nicer if they did a nice pillowcase. But anyway, less pain is better, isn't it? Now they do. I'll see if I can show it you. They do three different kinds of pillow uh, of pillows. I think depending on. Um, depending on what what your you know your problem is but i wasn't sure which one to get and they sort of i know i like a higher pillar and that was a higher pillar uh, but my pain's really lower back but it did help um now i'm just going to see if i can bring up and show you the other pillows now there's three different kinds of pillows for you know for the back obviously they've got other things as well 
and this one is a butterfly um it's called the butterfly shape pillow um and i'll put you the link in so there's um i don't know if you can see here i'll try and put you some screenshots in um there's uh one for your neck um this one the butterfly one there's a couple of butterfly ones and then there's an original cervical pillow with contour design um the here i'll see if i can put screenshots in i'm, I'm not too sure uh, i'll have a go <laughs> so i just thought i'd pop on now there will be a discount code i have to say i do recommend the pillow i gave it two weeks and i do feel my back does feel a lot better um you know i suppose it's something that you get with older age you know oh, Mabel's having a cry now is it because betsy's up here and you're not um so um i'll put all the details in the description box um i know i do i'm not just saying it i do recommend it makes no difference to me whether you get one or not you know they, they gifted me the pillow which i'm really happy about um so um i'll put the discount code um i'm not sure what it is actually um i'll find out i'll, I'll put it across the screen i'll put the discount code in and I'll put you the link to the pillow so you can just take a look. Now, sit back and watch my Marks and Spencer's haul. <laughs> Okie dokie. Hey everybody. It's Tina from Tina's Talk Time. I'm just coming on to show you a few things that I've, I've bought from Marks and Spencer's. Um, a couple of the things I've got in the sale. Well, four things, four items I've got it to, uh, at the end of the sale. I think they are still available. Well, they were when I looked yesterday. Um, so I'm going to show you those. There's two jackets, uh, which are the same but different colours. And then two dresses, which are the same material but different styles. Um, I had ordered these originally for the spring... Um, you know, when we did that spring clothing haul. Um, but actually, they didn't come in time. But it's a long story. But anyway, I'll show you them now. We'll be returning some of them. But I thought I might keep... I'm going to keep one of the jackets. And I may keep one of the dresses. I was going to send the dresses back. Because I don't really need a new dress. But I really liked them when I tried them on. But see what you think, anyway. Anyway, uh, the first thing I'll show you is... I bought these... Sh well, I ordered these shoes. These are going back because they pinch my toes. And, no... The, a lot of shoes nowadays are very narrow there, aren't they? And um, they're not leather, so I don't know whether they'll give. Uh, and they pinch my toes. But um, I actually wanted these in navy, but I didn't have them in navy. And I thought the pink might work, uh, but it doesn't. And also, they're quite uncomfortable, they knit my toes. But they were £25, these. So I just thought I'd show you them, but I like the height of the heel. That's really what attracted me to them. Um, so I was a bit disappointed with those, but they will be going back. Um, then the other thing that I wanted to tell you is um, that I have a Next account. So um, I always get notified when the sale's going to start. So you get like a sale preview, which is this Wednesday. But I would imagine the next sale will be in store on Saturday. So keep an eye out. And there'll be lots of things in that clearance section. So keep your eye on that as well. It's where I get most of my clothes from. So anyway, um, we'll get we'll get on. Um, do you know I never told you who I am? I'm Tina. <laughs> Tina talk time. Sorry, I forgot to tell you. <laughs> if you're new here, you'll probably think I'm a bit bonkers. But anyway, welcome. <laughs> And I've got so many loyal subscribers who I love to be. So um, thank you for coming back. <laughs> anyway, I'm a bit mad, aren't I? Anyway, it's probably my age, you see. I can, When you get old, you can blame a lot on that. Anyway, I'm going to get on now and show you the, the two jackets and the two dresses. And let me know what you think. Let me know which you think I should buy. Okay, see you in a bit. Right, so this is the first jacket I've tried on. Um, it's an unlined jacket, as you can see. Um, this is a size 18. It's an animal print. Um, it feels really nice on. Now, this is the sort of, well, brown and black animal print, like a beige black. Um, now, it was. There's no buttons. It's just like... Um, you know, like a cardigan type thing. 
Um, now this was originally thirty nine ninety nine, and in the sale it's twelve pound. Now I didn't see it in store when I went to Preston on Friday. They had it in store at twelve pound as well. Um, it's got two pockets. It is really nice. It feels really nice on. You know, in spring, I think this would be nice, you know, just for going shopping or something like that. So this is the first jacket. And as I say, it's £12. This is a size 18. It's £12 down from £39.99. So that's a good bargain. Now, this is the same jacket in uh, black and grey. Now, I prefer this colour. Uh, this one actually is £17. It's the same jacket, um, this one was 17 and that one was 12, it just must be the difference in colours. This is a size 18, it's very roomy. Um, I do like this, I thought this would be useful, you know, in spring, same pocket. Exactly the same um, jacket, only I think I prefer this colour, let me know which one you like best. I mean the other one, as I say, is £5 cheaper. But I just thought, I think I've got more that would go with this jacket. Although I do like the other one, they're both nice. So let me know which one you prefer. This one or the um, the brownie colour. As I say, they're quite roomy, so you could wear quite a thick jumper underneath. Um, I'll just get the other one again and then you can compare. So this is the black. See, now I've tried them on, I'm not sure which I like best. Let me know what you think. Obviously, I'm not having both of them. So that was the grey. I'll try this one on again. Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure which one I like best now. Let me know which you think's best. I just thought I've probably got more that goes with the um, the grey and black. But there, I mean, even at £17, it's a bargain because that one's 17 and this one's 12 But they're both nice colours, aren't they? Right, moving on to the next thing. Right, so this is a Nobody's Child dress from Marks and Spencers. And this is in the sale. Um, it was originally 55 and I paid 33. They did reduce it to 40 something and then they reduced it again to 33. Now the two dresses, it's just two dresses I'm trying on, are both in the same material but a different style. I love this blue colour, like a hyacinth blue, isn't it? I'll just tip the camera down a bit so you can see. I don't really, I'm not too keen on this split up the side there or the front, um, but there's a lot like that nowadays. But it's a lovely dress, it's a nice fit, it feels really nice. I like the sleeves, just went over on my shoe there. <laughs> I like the sleeves and I love the print. Isn't it nice? I love these sleeves. So this is £33, so I think that's quite a good buy. I'll just um, walk this way so you can see the back of it. Yes, it's really nice. It feels really comfortable. And I think it's a beautiful dress for spring. It's got some spring flowers on. <laughs> it is. I really like this dress. So I'm going to try the other one on. Now, the next one is in the same material. It's the same price. Uh, it had been 55 and is now 33 which is quite a good reduction. Um, so I'll try the other one and I'll let you see that. Right, so this is the next dress, exactly the same material. Same price, it's down to 33 from 55. It's a nobody's child dress. Love this colour, but this has got a lower neckline and a collar and it's like button up the front. I'll just step back and then you can perhaps see It's got the split the same, I think it has. Oh no, it's the split up the front, that's what I was thinking. So, 
I need your help. Which jacket should I keep and which dress? I'm definitely going to keep one of the jackets and I think I'm going, I was going to send both dresses back but I do really like them and they both feel so comfortable. So let me know which dress you think looks the best and which jacket looks the best. I do love the material. It's, it's, I love this blue bell colour, like a hyacinth blue, isn't it? So, so let, let me know which one you think. So which jacket, which dress? <laughs> right, I'll move on. Right, this is a bit of a mixed bag today. <laughs> uh, I'm going to show you uh, the Marks and Spencers haul, that, so that will be coming on in a minute. Um, first, um, I'm just going to give you a little update on a review that I've done of um, a cervical pillow, Zamat. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, Z-A-M-A-T, a uh, pillow that I was sent, uh, which is supposed to relieve backache, and it does. <laughs> well, it did for me anyway. <laughs> I mean, my back's still not perfect, but a lot. it is a lot better. You know, I feel like I've had a much relaxed sleep, sleep. Anyway, watch this. I'll show you two weeks ago, then now. And then the Marks and Spencers haul. So see you in a bit. Right, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed the haul. I hope you take a look at the pillow. Um, and I'll see you in my next video. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. <laughs> or please think about it. <laughs> I'm greedy, aren't I? And also, uh, the last thing that I'm going to do now is... Oh, no, this is... And at the end of the video, I'm going to announce the winner for the 4,000... Subscribers giveaway. Uh, so stay tuned um, and have a look at the pillow if you get chance um, and enjoy the Marks and Spencers haul and subscribe if you're not if you're not subscribed please subscribe and ring that bell and give me a thumbs up. Thanks a lot. Right, so um, this is a random comment selector. I've put the comments in and the um, YouTube video, so I'm just going to press here. So there's 159 comments. So I'm going to start it now. Pauline Holden, someone called Pauline Holden. Congratulations, Pauline, you've won the giveaway. It's a good giveaway as well. <laughs> okay, right, bye for now, everybody. See you next time. Uh, Pauline, sorry, before we go, could you just um, contact me via my email? It, it, it'll be in the description box, but if you could just send me your address and then I'll post off uh, all those lovely products to you. Okay, bye. Congratulations, Pauline.